One of the neatest new features to arrive in our September 2011 release of Mobile Nation HQ is our advanced editor. So what is the advanced editor? Well, it's everywhere. I can go along and take a label. Now in the past, I would have only been able to edit this on a single line basis, but now I can feed in rich text that can be dynamic, it can come in from other components, and I can even go along and insert my own code that I can go and debug on <coughs> a remote device. Uh, so to get started, I'm just going to go to the Apple iPhone 4 website and just rip up a little bit of content. That will do. Copy that. Now I'm going to go to my label, bring up my advanced editor, and I can literally just go along and paste that in. If I hit publish, you can see that that content is ready to view on a mobile. Looking at the content on our device, you can see that the content automatically scrolls to fit in. So really that's just the beginning. You can use the same drag and drop technology that you've gotten used to and put it straight into your layouts. So in this case I'm going to replace external buttons and controls here with the font name that we have on our device. I literally just drag that across and there it is. I republish that. But what's more is the power users of the product can go along and put in their own JavaScript code. So what I'm going to do is put in a button and wire it up to set the label's value but in this case I'm going to show some custom JavaScript code. So I'll just clear that up and I'll say alert hello world. Beautiful. All between those braces. See what that looks like. So I'll press on that button, and there's my alert. So let's go back to our builder and put in a dodgy value. There we go. Publish. Now when we touch on our button, we're going to generate a code error. But instead of just glitching out, we can figure out exactly where that error happened on line two. Where we think you might especially like the advanced editor though is on our table views and map views where you just want to show that little bit of extra detail. So what I'm going to do is open up a tutorial example, RSS drill down, and have a look at our table view. Now you can see what we have here is title. I'm going to go and change that to an advanced view and I'm going to put in my publish date on the right. Maybe I'll make the font size for that a little bit smaller. And then I'm going to put in my title and I'll make that one a little bit bigger. So that's just one of the many new features we have in our September 2011 release of Mobile Nation HQ. I'll try and put up a YouTube video every week to show you just how you can use some of the new features that we've got. Thanks for watching.